Preach. It's Destiny and can we talk about my bun? It's pretty ratchet. So I just want to apologize for not posting last week and I also want to apologize for my hair that is halfway ponytail, halfway bun. And I also want to apologize for my outfit and my face, so let's just push past that. So basically last week I actually did film a video. Our theme was no cut week, which means you can't do the little editing thing where it like goes to the next clip like I probably did already 20 times in this video. And it was a lot of fun, so I'll put a clip at the end of me prank calling this guy Eli. It was so funny. I actually look worse than I do now, so just a warning. And I also want to warn you guys, he used a lot of really, really, really bad language. So if you guys are really young or your parents are in the room, I suggest not watching that scene till later on in life or in the day. So it's going to be at the very end of my video after like the little links and all that stuff and you guys could check it out if you want. This week's theme is music and I thought since music theme I would just basically my summer playlist. Let's get started. Okay guys, so my first favorite summer song, this is probably like my most favorite summer song. It is Rude by Magic and I'm pretty sure I love that song because Aaron Carpenter did a cover of it but I also really love the original song and I don't want to be rude and keep you guys from hearing this so let's show you the clip if you guys didn't catch that I said rude and this song is called rude so can I have your daughter for the rest of my life say yes say yes cuz I need to know so my next favorite summer song, a lot of you hate it and the rest of you love it. So there's no in between. You guys either freaking hate this song or you're absolutely in love with it. So Shower by Becky G. I honestly used to hate that song with like a burning passion. Now I like, I'll be in my shower or standing in front of my mirror. I'll either be dancing in the mirror or I'll be singing in the shower. So I love this song because I can sing it in the shower. I don't have like a flirty thing to say for that one, so. I'll be watching you guys singing this song in the shower. To continue. So my next favorite song, this is actually I think the only country song on my list. I'm not really sure. Dirt by Florida Georgia Line is probably one of my favorite country songs right now. I actually forgot. I think I have one other country song on here. And what am I doing with my hair? What am I doing with my hair? My favorite country song right now is Dirt by Florida Georgia Line. And if you guys haven't heard this song, then you guys could eat dirt. That was just mean. I'm sorry. So my next favorite song is Am I Wrong by Nico and Vins. I think that's how you say it. I'm probably saying that wrong and I'm probably embarrassing myself. That probably is one of my favorite summer songs. I don't know why. Usually songs like that annoy me. I say that about a lot of songs. It's pretty good. Am I wrong or am I right? So my next favorite song is by Maroon 5 and it is Maps. I don't know if any of you guys love Maroon 5 as much as I do. I wish I had the map to your heart. So this one I actually heard from Bethany Moda and it is Dreaming by Small Pools. Am I dreaming or are you the most beautiful person in this room? I think about you when I'm dreaming. So this next one is actually also country and I totally forgot I had another country song. It is Bartender by Lady Antebellum and that song is just so good. If I was a bartender, I would give you free drinks for life because you're so attractive. Yeah, I said that. Wanna get a little lost in the noise, in the lights. Hey, bartender. So I'm not really a huge Fifth Harmony fan, but Boss by Fifth Harmony is such a good song. Like, it's so like, boom, you're a boss. So this 
first one, I'm not really sure if this is a huge song or not. I honestly get all of my favorite songs from iTunes. I just randomly will go down the top charts and listen to like all top 50 songs because I have no life. Leave the Night On by Sam Hunt is such a good song. Please leave the night on so I could creep on you through my window. Let's move on to the clip. We don't have to go home. We can leave the night on. We can leave the night on. So I kind of lied to you guys, there's actually one more country song, and Where It's At by Dustin Lynch is so... I can't even explain it, I love that song. Your bedroom is where it's at. It's is me. <laughs> what am I saying? Here's the clip. I swear, if she's there, that's where, yep, yep, that's where it's at. Thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and if you didn't then you should still give it a thumbs up if you guys have any requests for themes or challenges or tags or any of that stuff comment them below and Yasmin and I will check them out and make sure you're subscribed to this channel so you can watch all the girls videos along with mine every Wednesday and make sure you subscribe to my personal so you could see any of the other stuff I do I haven't posted on there in about a month or two I think so if you guys are like wanting me to post more then make sure you leave a comment on one of my personal videos and yeah well, thank you guys make sure you watch till the very end if you guys are interested in seeing my prank calling clip and i think that's all i have to say so bye You're looking sexy tonight. What? You're looking sexy tonight. There you go. May I borrow your virginity? Uh, that's already been taken a long ass time ago. Sorry. Oh, why is that unbelievable? <laughs> are you? Uh, you called me, dumb fuck. Excuse me? Excuse me, dumb shit. Uh, don't call asking people for their fucking virginity and shit. And call him a sexy fuck. When you don't even know who the fuck is. Shut the fuck up and don't ever fucking call this number again or I will fucking call the cops on you, motherfucker. Nana, who are you talking to? Nana?